Good morning and welcome to the Morning Minute. Today is Monday, January 11th. I hope everybody had a fabulous weekend. I'm here with our Morning Minute sponsor, Zach Bonham with Dowdy and Kroll. We are um, here filming as he's our sponsor for the next month, which I really appreciate. So if you're interested in sponsoring the Morning Minute, you can contact me and I can let you know what that's all about. First and foremost, I want to remind you that tomorrow is our monthly membership meeting. It is virtual. It's sponsored by Carter Lumber. That starts at 530 and the Zoom link will be included in that. So let's chat with Zach for a minute. Okay, Zach, you've been a member of the HBA for a while. Tell me a little bit about your involvement with the HBA and what you, you know, what committees you sit on and why you got involved. Well, I joined the HBA originally because I came from a contracting background. My dad owned a painting company for many years, still does. So that's how I got introduced to the business. So when I became an attorney, I realized that I wanted to work with contractors. So the HBA was a natural fit. Uh, I, I'm now on the membership committee. I've served on other committees in the past. I've uh, been to many of the events back when we could have events. <laughs> uh, so uh, the HBA has been great for one, for networking it. And second, made a lot of friends through the, uh, the association as well. Yeah, that's great. And the one thing we like is that someone who joins and they get involved. And obviously he realized that getting involved would be a good fit for him as well as, you know, get a return on his investment. Also, Zach does a legal column for us in our toolbox, which will come out this week. Tell us a little bit about why you think it's important to kind of have a legal column in our newsletter. I know why we think it's important because we want to make sure people have up to date information, but what is it that you like to write about in the column to kind of like make sure contractors or people in this industry know what's happening? Well, some of the basic things that as attorneys we think are basic things aren't always uh, forefront other people's minds. One of the things is contracts. So some of my articles will be about uh, contracts, different clauses you should have in them, things that people often overlook. Uh, and really this the necessity of contracts. A lot of people like to use a bid sheet which doesn't really have a lot of information and uh, also sometimes the, the vagueness of it will get you in trouble in the long run. Other things that we also see is uh, people don't always pay. So right. when uh, you don't get a payment, you need to put a lien on somebody's property. Uh, there's some magic language that the statutes re are required to have in a contract and a lot of people don't have those. So when I meet with contractors, uh, that's the first thing we look to. So the legal column will usually cover a lot of things to do with contracts for the most part. Yeah, that's great. And honestly, one of the things like starting to 2021, I mean, look at your contracts, see if everything's airtight, see if you need to update them. Zach's the perfect person to contact to do that. So I want to thank him for sponsoring the Morning Minute, and I hope everybody has a great week, and we will see you on the Zoom call tomorrow night at 530. Thanks, and have a great day. Thank you.